Now let's look at how you propagate uncertainties when you have logarithms or exponentials. Now let's say the resultant variable you want is equal to the natural log, log to the base e of your input variable v. What now? Well, we do the usual calculus trick. Uh, sigma r, the uncertainty in r, divided by the uncertainty in the input variable v, is dr by dv. So if you differentiate log v, that just comes as 1 over v. Which rearranging, we find the uncertainty in the result is just the uncertainty in the initial value divided by the initial value, i.e. the fractional uncertainty in the initial value. So let's have an example. Let's say that uh, no, um, x equals log y and y equals 4 plus or minus 0.1. In that case the uncertainty in x is going to be the uncertainty in y over y, which is going to be 0.1 over 4 equals 0.025. All pretty easy. How about exponentials? Well, let's imagine that our resultant variable is e to the input variable. Once again, differentiate sigma r over sigma v equals differential of e to the v, which is e to the v. Differentiate an exponential, you get exactly the same thing. That's the fun thing about exponentials. So what that means is that sigma r equals e to the v sigma v, which is just r sigma v. Or put another way, sigma r over r equals sigma v. Let's do an example of that. If x equals e to the y and y equals 4 plus or minus 0 0.1, then x equals e to the 4 equals 54.6 and sigma x equals x sigma y equals 54.6 times 0 0.1 equals 5.46.